both men and women experience painful sexual intercourse but it's more common in women but that doesn't make it normal i mean sexual intercourse should be pleasurable to both parties and a lot of women shy away from they shy away from communicating or talking to their spouses as related to how they should enjoy sex sex is sweet i mean it is sweet while it is sweet hi guys welcome to my channel if you are new on here my name is ada ade tunji go to the playlist you'll see a lot of contents that you will enjoy share 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 click 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 watch 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 while like that don't forget to hit on the subscribe button and also on the notification bell so that you get the videos as soon as i upload them to my all-time favorite viewers my returning subscribers you guys know already it's like this much love from me to you today we're going to be looking at the causes of painful sexual intercourse in most women and the possibility of enjoying sexual intercourse enjoying bed matics knocking enjoying the knocking left right and center okay so guys point to note before we start there are different causes of um painful um vj during bed matics uh, we have the physical causes, we have the emotional causes, and then the gynecological causes. Today, we're going to be focusing more on the physical and emotional causes. However, for whatever that leads to you having painful um, sexual intercourse as a woman, there's need for you to consult your doctor. I mean, if it becomes way too much and unbearable for you. So, um, let's go, guys. Okay, so sexual intercourse is not completely painless, actually. It's... Um, is that kind of pain that feel good kind of pain actually you know and it's not the one you want to endure your whole life and while your husband is dozing away you're looking for a fan or something to be coming your vj down it's not that kind of pain when it's nothing deep so if you're here today and you're always doing ah, uh, uh, trying to impress your husband and you're dying slowly let's look at it stop shy and shy okay so let's look at this in three ways where do you experience this pain when do you experience the pain and how do you feel this pain so for the where is it on the whole of the vj leading through the vj canal or is it deep inside if it's on the surface you could probably be dealing with some kind of dryness that we're going to be talking about in details or you could be dealing with trash that actually requires you to consult your doctor to manage if it's deep inside, you could obviously be dealing with some gynecological or medical infections. It could be cystitis, it could be fibroid, it could be endometriosis, you know, and that requires you to consult your doctor. Okay, so when do you feel this pain? Is it at the point of penetration? If it's that, that obviously you could be dealing with some level of dryness impacted by low um four plays and inadequate four plays or you could also be dealing with maybe urinary tract infection candidiasis this infection okay so beyond the dryness and the infections i mentioned there are also people who have this anxiety or fear of having sex so whenever penetration is attempted even with a finger or a joystick whatever sex toys or whatever that wants to enter the vj the muzzle vaginal muzzles tighten up on its own and these people have no control over this can it be treated can it be managed the answer is yes it requires a lot of education it requires a lot of counseling and some medicines this is for people who have what we call virginismus if it's during when Oga is you know increasing his tempo and trying to hit you know and ejaculate and all of these things it could also be a gynecological issue pids and the likes if it's after the whole knocking that you feel some kind of way if it's after the whole knocking that you feel some kind of way um you feel <clears throat> some kind of way it can actually be urinary tract infection or trash or things like that so if there are injuries or blisters around the vulva one could also experience pain after knocking and these injuries could be as a result of how the foreplay or the knocking was roughly done or if someone reacts to lattice there is going to be redness or swellings around the vulva sometimes people also react to semen or sperm which can also impact on the vulva and cause a burning sensation after knocking how do you feel the way you feel do you feel a burning sensation do you feel soreness 
or do you feel deep pain so in all of what i've mentioned the where the when and the how i could group the causes of vj pain during sexual intercourse as either um emotional causes or gynecological causes let's also include the physical causes yeah so we have the physical we have the emotional and the gynecological causes whatever way you feel however you feel and wherever you feel this pain if it becomes unbearable there's need for you to consult your doctor then let's look at possible reasons why you're feeling dry possible causes of dryness and how you could enhance wetness let's go okay so guys i have a meeting this morning i'm already running late my meeting is starting in the next um 12 minutes so i think i need to do a part two of um this topic uh at least we've already looked at the causes and let's look at um, possible reasons why you feel dry and ways to enhance bermatics in subsequent episode yeah i'm sorry i'm sorry you have the cut here so expect expect something really worthwhile at the end of this episode guy your name is nakamura just just go and mark yourself out so don't miss the next content okay if you're yet to subscribe feel free to subscribe right away and we get right into it bye guys love you all miss you already bye